lot of kids are coming this afternoon to tornadoes and I thought I'd do a before and after picture this is their room looks very nice right now nice and made up everything's neat but I'll show you an after picture a few minutes after they get here and you won't recognize it as being the same room <laughs> they have a way of doing it but anyway it's fun to have them love to have them love to mess love to clean up after them I'm sitting here waiting on the kids to come over. Where are they? They usually come rolling in here really fast, loaded down, but I don't see them. Because my mom wouldn't wake up. Taking a movie of you. We're gonna make a movie. Can you please point that thing off my face? Who wants to be the star? Not me. What? Can you please get that on my face? Not you? Please. <laughs> yeah, I, I know who the star is now because I know who wants to be in front of the camera. Hey, I. I can tell. The little stage girl. Right? My gosh, this looks like somebody's been living here for a year. I took a picture before y'all came in to show you how clean it was. Mm -hmm. And then I took a picture after y'all got here, which has been five minutes ago. Mm -hmm. So what are y'all going to do? I know what you're going to do. You just, you're I'm going to go fishing. All right, fishing? Mm-hmm. Let's do that. I don't want to wash my iPad for a few and hours. And you don't want to go fishing. So he doesn't want to go fishing. Please don't point that towards my face. They can take a picture of me. Fishing. We'll take a picture of you catching a fish. Oh, look at the ducks! Oh, look at whatever those things are. Ducks. You should. Ducks like grapes, you know that? They do. Jiggle it a little bit. And hold it like. Like while you said it, then like a fish came on to it. Like it was that's where you caught it. We can come back and try it later. Yeah. I'm 
watching Funny. Watching what? Funny. Her name is Funny. It's Funny. <laughs> Somebody doesn't want to be filmed over there. I can't see you. I gotta pull it through the sticks. There's some brush down there. Yeah, it got stuck. So pull it a little bit. Check it. Let's see if I can get it. Yeah. Or does it like just happen sometimes? Hook comes. Hooked, hooked oh my gosh! It just pulled the whole entire thing out of there. Well, yeah, I guess. It's really stuck on there. It's so cool that, it's so weird because the um, thing didn't break. The, like, part that holds it. Woo! And now throw that back where it belongs. Really, kind of. Eh. Your faces are going to look like iPads. I can't believe it. See? Abby doesn't even have a head anymore, so nothing but, a, it's nothing but an iPad in front of her face. And this one, not much different. Girls, what are we having this morning? I forgot. I forgot to. French toast. Oh, what kind of French toast? 
Um, well, maple famous. Maple French toast. All right, say it louder so everybody can hear it. Mm. World well, well, famous. World famous. Yes. yes. Very. My forte is over it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, how did y'all enjoy the mosh? Tell me about the mosh. Again. I drink the syrup. <laughs> no, no, just tell me about it again. The summer one was boring. Because you were all the with like the kids. When did you go? This last summer? No, I think the summer before last summer. Yeah, like when I was in second grade, summer thing. And I was the first. <laughs> And what did they have there? What did you see there? What did you do? We saw like di like dinosaur bones. But dinosaur like, bones? Yeah. No dinosaurs, just the bones? No, not really. No and rolls. they have, there, they actually have like dinosaurs there, but except they're not real. They're robots and they, they make noises and you can play games with them and stuff. And like, if you move like there's like these little things here, if you move them, then the dinosaur can move around. Oh. Did they, did y'all camp there or did you um, stay overnight? Uh, we just went there for the day. We, yes, just for the day, for a little bit, for a little while, and then we just went. There. Uh, tell me about um, surf camp. You, I know you really liked it. Yes. What was it like? Who who taught the surf camp? Well, they had like a bunch of different people, like um, staff. And each staff got their group of like four kids, and each of them kind of went out in groups out um, into the water and got to surf. And sometimes they'd help push us, other times we just swim. And do Were you that. able to go out and catch your own wave before the end of the week and um, and, and ride it back in? Where you did you get to that point? Yeah, mm -hmm. you did. Mm -hmm. How about you? Did what? How was how was yours? Good. You're small, so you should have been able to do pretty good up on the surfboard. I did, but I did fall a lot of times. Like, once I fell, and then I hit the floor of the beach, and then I went, and then I just like... Made did you it. wear life jackets? No. No? But we did wear a little, um, long sleeve rash guards. It was so delayed. That had, um... Jack surf camp on them, so they knew we were part of the group. Yeah, but it's really annoying. But if you, if, if you fell off, you didn't have any kind of life jacket or anything or float. But we all knew how to swim. I mean, you have to. Know yeah, we had to take a swim test. We really had. How big were the? Test. How big were the waves? Uh, first day waves were like normal. pretty normal. They were perfect for surfing. Second day, a little bit, a little bit like rougher, a little but like still it was like right here to me. No, Just they so. were still perfect. Um, third day got hectic, like the waves were humongous. Yeah, it went the over our heads. fourth day. It went, over if you, your head. If you look over, like against the side, then you can see every single person, like every, so like the big wave when it comes, then it crashes, and then when you look over, when you're done, you see a bunch of boards flying in the air, and it's oh. really weird. Oh my gosh. Oh, and on the fourth day, I mean, that was the craziest one. Oh, the waves were humongous, oh, yeah. and we even got caught in a bit of a storm because there was rain everywhere. I know, I told the co I told my captain, which he was a new person there, and I told him, it's raining, shouldn't we just get out? Because this is when the big waves start coming. And he's like, no, <laughs> it's actually perfect for time. Yeah, that's how it's a, you, you know what? The, the, the good surfers are those people that taught the lessons. You know what they do? They wait for the storms to come in, and then they go out when the waves are really big. And that's when they like to surf in the real big waves. Yeah. I but like you didn't care for the real big waves. I don't like the big, big waves where you they like just the go baby, over them. You like little baby waves. Yeah. I like the normal ones where they just go like that. And then they I don't blame you. I would, too. Yeah, because the ones that are so big, they're like, what do you surf? Um, did you do any practice surfing when you went out to your uh, beach condo? Mm -hmm. Uh, Sophie, I did. Yeah, yeah. Did yeah. you? I did. All every time we went so far, I've been surfing the whole time. You ought to be getting a lot better then. Hmm? You ought to be getting better. A lot better. Uh huh. And uh, something that was really fun at surf camp is that we brought like our favorite cousins pretty much. And we also brought my best friend and we pretty much hung out at the house, the condo. Uh, and my best friend became, he, she now knows like, Brooks cousin. Who is your best friend? 
Madeline Jackson. She's so nice. Is she? Yeah, and she goes to school with you? Mm hmm She was in my class last year, the year before that, and this year. And next year, I'm pretty sure um, they're doing this gifted program thing where all the fifth graders mm -hmm. uh, do... It's either if you want to do gifted, you do gifted all the time. Like, mm -hmm. there's not just one right. day a week, it's all the time. But, or you can have the opportunity to not do gifted, where you're just doing regular school with no gifted time. Mm -hmm. And I know which one I'm going to pick, so I'm going to get in class. Does she now. live near you where you can play? I mean, where oh, you yeah, can see she's in the street right next to us. So oh, so you get to see each other a good mm -hmm. bit. I'm at the beginning of my street, and she's towards the middle of her street. So my mom was saying that maybe some days I could ride my bike to her house. And yeah. sometimes uh, they pick me up from school, and we have a little play date. And after the play date, my mom calls telling her mom for me and my that mom be to good meet idea. for me and my mom to meet at the corner. So I just start walking down the street while she walks down the street, and then we meet each other at the corner, and then we both go down to oh, our cool. house. That'd be cool. Really How about cool. you? You got a best friend at school? Yes, but she didn't get in the class with me. She got with one of no. the most strict teachers in the school. Mm -hmm. Oh. That's who I got. Does she live All there of you? my friends really got in the same class, but not me. Do you have any friends on your street you play with? Jackson and Richard, but no. But the kids across, like, you all play with the ones across the street, right? Yeah. Yeah, Jackson and Richard Black. They're literally the only kids that are near our age. The rest of them are in like, college, middle school, babies in preschool, or old people who are retired. Yeah, our our like next door neighbor, like right next to us, they they have a little kid. They have like a young child, like like three years old or four. Like she just turned four, and she had a petting zoo for her birthday, and um. So, she's like the youngest one on our street. Well, there's also more younger ones on mm -hmm. our street. Like, one of them's like one years old. On, well, let, on me the ask you, let me ask you this one at a time. Let me ask you first, Sophie. Mm -hmm. Now, you're, 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 you're on what, 10? Mm -hmm. You're 10 now? Yes. No, wait. I'm going to be 10 in a month. But, yeah. You'll be 10 in November? No. You'll be, you know you're only 11 in November. Mm -hmm. How old are you right now? Nine turning ten. Oh, you're nine. September you're turning 10. ten. I was thinking you're already ten for some reason. I wasn't already ten. Okay. Well, you're still you're still really young. You don't act right but now. But what do you think now? You don't act ten. Wait, be quiet now. Hold on. What do you think at this young stage in your life, if you had to start working and doing some job, like your dad's a lawyer yeah. or something like that, what do you think you would want to be at this stage in your life? Although I'm sure it'll change probably, but what do you think? Down so I can see you. I'm good at this. Um, veterinarian. Veterinarian? Mm -hmm. Well, you like animals? Mm -hmm. Well, Gertie is certainly an animal. Mm -hmm. And Gertie is uh, certainly a spirited animal. Mm -hmm. Gertie, I think Gertie should be taking the surfboard classes with you. Mm -hmm. Don't you? <laughs> well, I saw. There is a class. I saw it on um, YouTube of the dogs or Facebook. The dogs taking surfing classes and they ride with their masters on the surfboard. And they they sit on there and they go some and some big waves. I see people doing that, but like I saw someone do that. But we were at the beach, but it was kind of hard to see because the dog kind of like. I kind of like looked like the human, like it blended in with the human legs, so I couldn't really see hey, any. Remember how lots of people go past the brake line with their dogs and sit on their surfboard doing yoga with their dog? Oh my gosh, it's a doga. Mm -hmm. I do. I. I uh, all right, now I'm gonna ask you. Now you're really young, so what would uh, if you had to go to work and do a job? What do you think you would want to do? I would be a veterinarian. You, you, you both be veterinarians? No, I want to. I'm kicking her out of my office. I will be the manager and she is fired. Uh -oh. She's my sister. You, she's you would do like Donald Trump says, you're fired. Yes, because she, um, she's my sister. 
So what kind of animals would you like to work on the scream, most? She's going to scream at all the dogs. She's going to be like, ah, it's a puppy. Well, you know, veterinarians don't work on just dogs. <laughs> yeah, but that's what she's going to do. She's going to look They up. work on all the animals. I know, but she's going to look at all the dogs and go, oh, my God, it's a puppy. Just like they're petting all the puppies. And when a cat comes, she's going to be like, not a cat. You would do I'm that. I'm allergic to cats. I don't actually think I should be a veterinarian because I'm allergic to cats and there's probably going to be a lot of cats just Yeah, Abby's going to be like, there's a cat, I'm out of here. And then, wait, I could just say every single time, we, every single time I work, and if there's a cat, then Sophie take it. Well, you know, they also Sophie work. Take think if you had to work on a bird or a snake. A uh, snake? I'm going to cut the snake's belly open. <laughs> I, would, I would give the snake to a lot different A lot of people have pet snakes. I would give the snake to a different person to do. You would? Uh-huh. And then bird. if it was a bird? Surgery. I would love it. I love birds. And you would scream at all the dogs. <coughs> Abby, I can just imagine you being a I would talk veterinarian. To, I would talk to the bird of what's happening to tweet. him. Tweet, and tweet, then I'd be like, tweet, 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 tweet. And then he'll tweet, say, tweet, 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 tweet. I don't think you really want to be a veterinarian. <laughs> I think you, I think you might be a good um, movie star. There you go. Yeah, you could be a great an movie star. An actor. An actress. Actress. Yes. An actor. An actress. What else? No. Well, I saw. Well, I saw. Give me a sweet face. Give me a sweet smile. Yeah. I'm not touching that little thing. That little thing. Yeah. What are you even a pet? I am a berry. Oh. Daddy berry. Thank you.